started crying. She's gonna, never gonna admit that she cried, but she did. I've gone through so many age groups with this girl, honestly. <laughs> glowing up, not growing up, eh? Yeah, glowing up, not growing up. <laughs> First senior call ups, that must feel so, so good. Where were you when you got that call? I was actually in my house, but I have no signal where I am because there's like, yeah, loads of fields and trees and that. So I missed two calls. I know, I know. And then eventually, Sadia. Imagine if she just thought, you know. I know. Yeah. <laughs> I've had Pick enough someone of else. Yeah. <laughs> She's bloody nightmare. <laughs> so um, the calls don't come through. So then I think she tried WhatsApp and then it finally come through on WhatsApp because it's Wi Fi and I seen a picture and I was like, no way. And then I picked it up. She told me and I was like, wow. I need to sit down in a cuppa. <laughs> you love your cuppas, to be fair. I saw you in Arrivals, you and your, you and your team. Where were you when you got, you got this call? The yeah. call that you must have dreamt about. I know, I was driving and then obviously I missed it again. So she's probably thinking these little ones are always on the phone and then I had to. But, but yeah, um, obviously I went on WhatsApp then seeing a picture. I was like, oh my. So I oh, when you get a call and you don't recognise yeah. the number, then you look. Oh, yeah, I so I had to see it was soon. I was like, maybe I should call her back. <laughs> And I called and obviously she told me the great news and then yeah, it was brilliant. So yeah, you eventually answered, got to chat to Serena. Yeah. And how, how was that call? Were you calm? Did you manage to kind of Compo keep your composure-ish? <laughs> I was composed for the call, but then I feel like after I just lost composure and I was just, yeah. yeah. Little scream out that calm window, <laughs> yeah. I Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hunk yeah. horn. <laughs> <laughs> got to be done. And who was the first person you told? My mum. Yeah. yeah. I FaceTimed and she was like, stop lying, Cara, stop lying. Stop, stop lying, lying, brilliant. I was like, mum, I'm being serious. And she started crying. She's gonna, never going to admit that she cried, but she did. That's just how it goes. <laughs> and how's it been? What's your first impressions of, of the camp? Anyone taking you under their wing? Well... <laughs> Lucy Bronze begging for... <laughs> begging to be out. said that she's the best player ever. To be fair, I knew quite a few of the girls from United, so that's quite nice. And then the northern ones, like Hempo and... Um, Esme and that, so it's like it's sort of like being a, you know, you know a lot of them anyway. Yeah, I suppose yeah. you're the same. It's a lot of your teammates, yeah, really, isn't it? Yeah. And then obviously Kira, Lucy, and George, who all used to be at City, so yeah, they're yeah. all very welcoming. Yeah, yeah, they are. And I guess you've played with these girls like at all the different levels for England as well. So really, it's you know, it's just a family, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because I can imagine otherwise it'd be quite scary coming to a situation like this, senior camp, you know. Professional international football, but actually you're kind of just like it's my mates. Yeah, <laughs> a few right. like some obviously still big names, and you're coming into yeah. like um, you don't hang out with them all the time, do you? But yeah, they've been so so welcoming, so it's lovely. Who were your like England icons growing up? Like who did you both watch on TV and think, oh, what a player! I'd love to play for England. <laughs> Joe Hart. Yeah, Joe Hart. of course. I mean, or really Karen Bazzi. Yeah. Female Karen Bazzi, England. Like men's Joe Hart. Yeah. Yeah, Karen's so, elite as yeah, well. Is. Have you yeah. met her? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously, when I first like, moved up to the seniors at City, she was like the starting goalkeeper. So she just took me under her wing and then, yeah. Me and KB are quite close. Oh, I love that. Mm. Yeah. So, how important do you think it's been for you to go through all the different levels with England? Like, have you got loads of fond memories of? Why are you laughing? <laughs> I've gone through so many age groups with this girl, honestly. We've had a laugh, haven't we? Yeah. we had, we've had really close groups mm -hmm. at England and, um, like, like, again, like a family. So, yeah, yeah we've had some funny moments. <laughs> she, this one, oh my God. But yeah, I feel like, as Grace said, we were just so close. And I think on and off the pitch, that helped so much. Yeah. And how's the glow up been since since those younger years to now? <laughs> We've glowing up. Let's just yeah, that. you reckon? You reckon? Yeah. <laughs> glowing up, not grown up, eh? Yeah, glowing up, not grown up. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. You two always having fun, but coming into this camp, was there anything you were a little bit nervous about? Uh, I think it's just like how you're gonna fit in the dynamic of the group. Obviously, there's already so many big characters, but yeah, I think everyone's been so good and welcoming so I feel like we just slipped right in. It was nice to do our first session today but obviously you can tell the difference like it's a world-class level and you've got to be switched on the whole time you know even in training it's just you can never switch off which is you know you're gonna get the hang of. Yeah you say that you guys have been pretty switched on for your clubs recently <laughs> absolutely flying <laughs> plenty of clean sheets for you Are you just feeling really good at the moment. Yeah obviously we had a great pre-season and then obviously it's just led into the season and 
As a team, I feel like this season at City was so much more together than we was last season. Obviously, it's showing in the results. And you, first first goal for the Spurs account. You thought, you know what? I'm not going to miss it out. I'm just going to. It's going to be a wonder goal. <laughs> no, it was it was nice to score that goal, but obviously, since I joined Spurs, the manager has just given me so much confidence. So to play with that and you know be trusted on the pitch is really nice. So I'm really enjoying life there. Yeah. Have you scored for England? Got any celebrations planned? <sighs> Lap in the oh pitch. <laughs> if I ever scored a goal, in. I'm like this. I'm doing MAS. <laughs> I mean, you have to, right? Nah, yeah. That would be oh, so nice. Imagine the last minute. A screamer in the box. Oh. You can get an assist easily. Yeah, yeah, but I feel like 90th minute winner, last corner of the game, just. Doosh. He's manifesting it. Manifesting it. Yeah. <laughs> Well, good luck. You seem to both have slotted right in. I'm excited to watch you shine for England. Yeah, keep smashing it. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Offside. <laughs> Was I shouting that loud? Manchester. <laughs> what? Offside. <laughs> what? Celebration. Yes. Yeah. Are you so happy? Yeah! <laughs> I thought it was going to be bad! <laughs>